A groundbreaking procedure is happening right now here in New York. NYU Langone calls it a big leap forward in organ transplants. Doctors say they've been able to transplant a genetically engineered pig kidney into a human, and it's worked for more than a month so far. News for Rana Novini has details. When 57-year-old Maurice Miller died suddenly from an undiagnosed brain tumor, his sister Mary was met with an unexpected choice. It, it was a very difficult decision. Mary sharing her brother's story alongside doctors at NYU Langone Health. Maurice, or Mo as she calls him, was brain dead. But with his heart and other organs still functioning through a ventilator, Mo was an ideal candidate for a groundbreaking study, transplanting a kidney from a pig into a human body. Knowing the type of person that he, he was or he is, it, it, it made it a little bit easier when uh, Livon had approached me. This study and others that will follow are going to be um, extremely important contributions. Dr. Robert yeah, Montgomery, chair of the Department of Surgery, One sharing of promising results. This is the fifth time doctors at NYU Langone have performed what's called a xenotransplant. Previously, the trials have only lasted a few days. But enter Mo and the surgery conducted more than a month ago. This is now the longest period that a pig kidney has functioned in a human, and doctors will continue to study the results for another month. The pig kidney appears to replace all of the important tasks that the human kidney manages. The pigs used are genetically bred to match more closely to humans. Doctors hope it's a step toward conducting trials in living people, creating a sustainable supply of organs for transplant, a relief to the tens of thousands who are forced to take their chances on a waiting list. My youngest brother um, passed away 15 months after he was born of kidney disease. For Mary and her family, the idea of furthering research around kidney function hits home. And now, she says, through Mo's death, he offers a gift to humanity. It is only fitting that his final act, he will be helping so many in the need through this innovative medical advancement. Rana Novini, News 4 New York.